So we got through Festival of the Cost, but now dawns a new paywall. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, break the ice on this video, if you know what I mean. Wink wink, nudge nudge, you see what I did there? Yeah you did. So the dawning, what is it? Well you're about to find out. The dawning is a new winter event or summer, Christmas event, whatever you want to call it, wherever you live on this planet, whatever time of the year it is, it's the event for this time. And it's gonna be going from the 13th of December to the 3rd of January, so across the new year. And what's going to be happening in this beautiful event, you ask? Well, like I did with that cheesy intro there, we're going to be getting the icebreaker back. That is the main thing to take away from this. That beautiful exotic from year one that destroyed PvE events with its reoccurring ammo. It's back with two new ornaments as well. And along with that, we've also got two new exotics, which are actually old ones that we saw back in the Taken King, back with all that stuff. It is the Solar Lord and the Void Lord. Yes, we're finally getting those exotics. And I can't wait to get my little guardian mitts on them and blast through some void shields and some solar shields. But alas, that is not it. We are getting new ornaments for the Red Death, the Thorn, the Black Spindle, and the Last Word as well. Oh, finally we're going to be having a different looking Last Word kill us in the Crucible. That's what we really want. What's that you say? There's more? Yes, there is. SRL is also back, and once the event is over, it is going to be in private matches as well. So with that, we're going to get two new tracks, which are on Mercury and the Plaguelands, and we're also going to get new Sparrows as well, and a new record book for this as well to get different as things along the way through our treks across the tracks and whatever you want to be doing during your SRL events. Mainly just honking your horns. Other things we're going to be getting is new armor, which is actually old armor that they have taken and bumped up the rare quality to the legendary quality. So your blues are going to be purples now. Isn't that lovely? There's also going to be other different armors as well with what I assume to be ornaments as how they look in the video but I haven't really heard much else on that or read much else on that as well. And moving on to one of the other big things that is coming within the dawning, strike scoring. That's right, you heard it. We're finally going to get some scoring and strikes. So you can verse your buddies and do whatever you want to do, find out who has the better strike run or who gets the most kills, the most multi kills, whatever you want. But with those strikes, we're going to be getting some revamp strikes. We're going to get Tanix. He's going to be Savified, apparently, according to the Destiny universe. And we're also getting the Nexus Mine back, finally. And what seems to be a new mechanic as well as we see some stuff with the Vault of Glass shield in the Nexus Mine. And just like the Festival of the Cost, there's going to be more microtransactions from Eververse, our favourite part of Destiny. But if your wallets weren't hurt enough from Festival of the Cost, we're going to be getting new consumables and new masks. So look forward to forking out some dough for that. And we can't forget the beautiful new looking tower, which is probably the coolest tower we've ever had, with all the snow looking things and the presents lying around, and that beautiful little robot doing a snow angel. I wonder if that's the same one that had the broom taken away. But that's not it either. We are getting new emblems and shaders, and because it's that beautiful Christmas time of the year, we're going to be getting a gift every day during this event. Now that brings us to the close of this video. If you guys do want me to do a more in-depth video on the trailer, then let me know in the comment section below and I will analyze the absolute crap out of it for you. But like I said, that's the end of this video. If you did enjoy, leave a like and favorite and maybe drop a cheeky subscribe. If you guys do have any other video suggestions for this channel, then drop them in the comment section below and I will definitely get around to creating it for you. But alas, Guardians, I'll see you in the next one. Bye. It ain't my fault.